Good morning everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Railroader. And welcome back to another beautiful day. So. It is time. For us to begin. Another round of Stream Raiders. Yes. There we go. I know it's Monday. And I know it's early in the morning. But I'm fully confident. In your ability. To build a massive army. And chat. We're gonna need that. Because we are about to finish 10th trial. And we need to finish it today. So, let's head on to that extreme boss. And let's see how far we can go. I'm gonna start off slowly with only a healer let's see if that's gonna work so chat the rest is on you it is your it is our first attempt to beat iris i wonder how many of them we will actually need Yeah, that's that's a good question, chat. That is a good question. Well, there's only one way to find out, isn't it? Right. So, chat. Let's get back. To Ray Roder. Where have we finished? So it's 4 a.m. in the morning. So I'm fairly sure that there is already something waiting for me at the interchange. Whoa, ho, ho, chat. So many, so many. Yes, chat. There is a lot. We got call hoppers for Robinson Gap. That is something we will have to address. We got cars for Stenzel, Holyfield Heating, Appalachian Hardwoods. Okay, quite a lot of stuff. Quite a lot of stuff, chat. Not so much. For paperboard and all the surrounding areas. That's good. How's our finances? We only got $3,000. Ah, yes. We haven't made much out of silver paperboard and Parsons Tannery. That's the reason why. We don't quite have that much money. Okay. Hmm. We got this one lonely car for Bryson Coaling Tower. We got this stuff for standard oil. 
and this stuff for Robinson Gap. Okay. So let's do some shunting. Uh, first of all, I need to pick up standard oil, Appalachian hardwoods, and all this stuff. And push it onto this truck. Yes, that's that's the first thing that is going to happen. Uh, I'm going to get all that to Dillsboro. Where we will now assemble freight trains. But it needs to be set in appropriate order. So let's go into ARC 203. Road forward 15. Okay, so when we get out uh, Bryson and Robinson Gap stuff, and then we will have to work on Whittier stuff. And Whittier Sawmill has a lot of cars. Look at this. Okay, there's some stuff from Stenzel, Whittier House Truck, and Holyfield uh, Heating Oil. Uh, but in general, most of the stuff is going to. Whittier. Locust Pin and CO is the last stuff we need to move. Okay. Okay. There's gonna be quite a few things to move. Yes, that's for sure. Assemble the string here. Okay, that thing goes to Connelly Creek, which means that all the cars are now ready to be removed. That's very good. Also, at the other end of the route, at Bryson, we have a small problem. And that is ARC 201. Uh, you do reverse 15. And you should probably stop around here. So we can send you to do refueling. Yes, that's that's the plan. Uh, now passenger train. Passenger train is currently a completely different story because. There was an update, chap. There was an update to the game. And with that update, 
they've changed the behavior of AI engineer. And now AI engineer will stop at the station when passing through it. As long as the cars uh, have that station on the list. So you need to still somewhat manually manage your passenger train. But right now it requires much less work. Okay, and there is a hard handbrake on one of those cars. This one and let's release this one. Okay. And two or three may now reverse. This one can go forwards, and in the meantime, I need to figure out how to deal with passenger train. Mm, so the passenger train is supposed to go to Hemingway, uh, but I'm a bit out of water. So definitely, that needs to be changed. But first things first. Now this one needs to go forward. Okay. I need to refuel. 201 reverses here and then we can get the passenger train on the move uh, let's have a look at 401 uh, that is also ready to be refueled oh okay it is refueled okay perfect now we need to choose appropriate truck for our freight train. I think we might just do this one. Okay, that will do. Uh, we'll figure it out in a minute. Now, let's go to interchange. And this cut should be ready to connect with... With the Bryson Calling Tower.
I managed the wrong train. Uh, I need to go. Yeah, I accidentally managed the wrong train. There we go. That, that's the train that I need to do. Uh, forward five. See, chat, early in the morning and I'm making silly mistakes. I guess it wouldn't be my channel if if we wouldn't see some mistakes like that. Very good. Let's connect the glad hands. Fantastic. Now we can disconnect that. We still got plenty of coal and water. Now we need to pick up this cut for Robinson Gap. for what then? Bit dark. Light this one break. The first fifteen. There we go. Perfect chat. Perfect.
Okay, this is going to reverse. Uh, let's have a quick look at 201. It should now be at the calling tower. Perfect. Uh, let's this one. We'll now slowly... Refill. To be honest, it doesn't really need much to refill. And s but since I'm on it, I might as well do it. go The water is water is now filled in. We can now reverse. Now there. The Z needs to be extinguished. The switch needs to go there. And we should be good to go onto this siding. In the meantime, passenger train can now go forward. Okay. Okay, and this one needs to go yard, reverse, two. And that's it. Wonderful. Right, and this needs to be thrown again. To be honest, I completely forgot which one is it. Is it this one or this one? This one. That's where the fusee has to be. Yeah. Two ties after the pole. Okay. 
probably throwing that switch would help a lot. Right, so while this locomotive is making this tiny shunt maneuver, I can connect them two cuts forward. Five. Wonderful. I think that is it. Okay, so the only problem we have right now is Ela Farm Supply. That needs to be extracted and ideally put in front of Holy Hill, uh, Holyfield heating oil. Which is going to be a bit of a pain. Not impossible task, but uh, yeah, it, it's gonna be a bit of a hassle. Right, anyway, uh, this one needs to go road reverse. There we go. In the meantime, we can head on to Bryson. Throw that switch. And reverse the movement of ARC number two. Wonderful. Now let's head on to Bryson. Okay, so we got... Uh, this one has some water. This one has plenty of water. Uh, 103 might need some refueling before we start using it. But there's going to be plenty of time to do so. Let's have a look. Just 
there anything there is one for silver interchange okay there is a bit of chanting around here but we we should be able to handle that even with basic mogul obviously this y uh, we can use it to reverse or change directions Okay, and there is 203. Is it 203 is currently at paperboard. It's stopping. Fantastic. That is the first cut. That will make its way. Where are you going? Let's just reverse the movement of ARC203 because we need it to, to do some extra work. Perfect. Now let's quickly go to interchange and let us throw this switch. So 203 will go past. And then we will reverse to pick up Ila Farm Supply R1. And that is the car that I will need. Then I need to push Silver Paperboard out of the siding. Reverse back onto this track. Pick up Ila from, from the other side and leave Paperboard stuff. And then we can extract this and reverse onto this truck pick up all that stuff well uh, connect the stuff together then go through the middle and push it out towards the train that is waiting at silver paperboard and then hopefully we will be able to move it to Dillsboro or if we want will get 401 from Dillsboro to actually go to paperboard and pick up the train. Either way, it will work. Right, chat, the battle is ready. Well, it's early in the morning, so I can say, yeah, we... I, I, I think we, we had a bit of misunderstanding here, chat. Because it's early in the morning, I, I can understand that, but, uh, you know, it's, it's... I, I don't think four units is gonna be enough to beat this bomb. Yeah, chat. You know, just as I somewhat predicted, yeah. It, 
beating this boss might prove a little bit more difficult than I thought. So, chat. Chat. Let's try again. I am not going to give up. Right, chat. One more time. This time the battle has changed somewhat. Uh, it is a bit... Yeah, the map is a bit different, but the boss remains the same. Okay, we, we got those explosive phoenixes. I, I don't think placing our tiny army on this side would do us any good. We got centaurs. Uh, these, these guys can shoot arrows. Harpies are very dangerous and phoenixes are really angry units it's really hard to choose a good place to start but I think we should start in here and I'm going to use a necromancer He's currently at level 4. There we go. That's going to be a good start. And let's get back to the game. Right. 203. Oh, 203. I, I gave him the wrong order. I am genius chat. Yeah, and, and it made its way between Dillsboro and Silva. Wow. Oh well. That only means we have some extra time that we may use. Before the train comes back. Okay, let's get one or two reverse. And I need that water.
Perfect. Well, looks like I still remember how to place a fusee so that ARC-102 will stop exactly where it has to. Get some water. Perfect. Okay, so we got 3,500 gallons of water. Let's go to the 15. Wonderful. Right. Uh, in the meantime, 203. Okay, 203 is still passing through the paperboard. Well, that's going to be a busy day, chat. Busy day.
Very good. Let's go to the interchange. 203 as expected. We now go in reverse. So I need Ila Farm Supply to find its way to this truck. Then I need to reverse back again. Pick up Parsons Stannery from this side. Push it out. Go from the other side, connect to Ila Farm Supply, leave paper bot stuff behind, go through with Ila Farm Supply and connect it to the other end. And then this entire cut in this exact configuration needs to be connected to the end of the train that is waiting at paper board. Meaning that I will have to disconnect, go around, and push it out. Hang on, I am in the wrong locomotive. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, okay. This one managed to actually couple. Very good. Right, let's double check the switches. And let's see.
if they strain will actually do a good job so D18 Pacific is now heading to Alarka Junction that's where this train has to stop but in the meantime there is also Hemingway and I think we got at least one passenger for Hemingway yeah we, we got 12 in fact so let's see if ARC 102 will actually perform passenger stop at Hemingway because that's how it is configured Okay, so this part of the job is finished. Now this one needs to be reversed. There we go. We can set it to yards reverse 20. It should be just perfect distance for us to reach paperboard stuff. this is happening need to throw that switch There we go. There we go. Right, so now we will pick up ELA Farm Supply or GCL 
There we go. That can now be thrown. Yard forward 20. So that we are sure that this will be connected. Uh, also, we got 202 here. And 202 is still connected to those L2s. How many of them we got? Six. Why there's only six cars for L2? Oh my days. Check out what's going on on Connelly Creek. Of course, uh, he he stowed two cars for for deciding instead of putting all eight of them. Uh, okay. Let's fix it then. Close that switch. Let's go to Connelly. Here at Connelly, that needs to be set here, and that needs to be set so this train will actually go here. These ones are technically fully loaded, but we will just put the rest of the cut in here and wait for everything to actually load. In the meantime, 203 is precisely where we want it to. We can now disconnect this car. Okay. Okay, I just confirmed that it arrived at Hemingway Station.
Okay, AI engineer is waiting at the stations for exactly the amount of time that I set it for, which is brilliant. Uh, I don't know why, but the game set it so AI will wait for entire 10 minutes, which is way too long. I obviously don't want it to stay at the station for that long. So I put it back uh, to two minutes, which is still longer than it technically should be. Um, but just for safety reasons, I, I set minimum time to two minutes. So, while we are getting ready with the train, I might... Get this train on the road. Reversing, keep reversing. I need this switch. might go for maximum length. There we go. Perfect. 
Cat, the battle is ready to begin. Well, Cat. I have to admit that this is much, much better than the previous one. It will still be rather difficult battle, but I, I think with this motivational blessing, we will be able to defeat our enemies. Okay, first enemy units are falling. Oh no, my necromancer has fallen. And we won. <laughs> Well, I, I wish we could say we won by a landslide, but that 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 was uh, by <laughs> by a hair, to be honest. It's uh, wow. Whew. That 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 was very very close one, but we succeeded. Chat. We won, and that's what matters. And chat. The last trial begins now. Trial of Atlas. And there are some difficult battles to go through. Right, since uh, from what I can see, we, we don't really have uh, large numbers today. Hmm, Th those two routes are completely separate. We we won't be able to cross the paths. Chat, uh, it, it is a very difficult decision now. Shall we go with the easy path? Or shall we go with the more difficult path? We still got seven days and eight hours to finish it. Hmm. That's an interesting challenge. That is indeed an interesting challenge. There is Atlas. Okay. You know what, chat? I have a faith in you. Let's go with hard challenge. We will enter this difficult path to victory. While we are on it, we will definitely be victorious. Right, I shall place my healer here. And the rest is on you, chat. The rest is on you. I have faith. And I believe in your abilities to build a massive army that will defeat our enemies. And with doing so, you will gain... An epic loot and reward. It's all on you, my dear fellow soldiers. It's all on you.
Meanwhile, in another universe, uh, we are preparing our heavy freight train to depart. So the locomotive is now ready. Waiting. For the rest of the wagons. And that will be connected. To this locomotive. Right. I think we got enough space there. Uh, 203 should now also be ready. Yes, it is. We can set it in reverse. In fact, reverse 20. We just need to connect to these organs. There we go. In the meantime, we got. Uh, let's see what's going on at Alarka Junction. Why is this? Hang on. Oh, so Alarka Junction Station also has a truck in here. And since this junction was set send me here train just stopped continued forward and oh my days okay i like the new button copy to couples Just reverse the direction. We are low on water. But we should be fine. Passenger stop is being performed by AI. Okay, okay. And now the train is going to wait for entire two minutes before it continues to Hemingway, Bryson, Ela, Whittier, Wilmot, Hillsborough. And it will stop at Silva. And at Silva I need to remember to stop it. Because otherwise it will just continue. So there is still some management that you need to do with the passenger train. 
It's not as good as the mod used to be. But it's definitely better than it used to be in vanilla. Okay. Road reverse 15. Now let me check. I need this junction so I can connect them two together. To be honest, chat, I'm still debating whether I should um, get heavy freight locomotive all the way here. And if the freight train should actually start from this siding. Which would probably make more sense. Yeah, let's let's get 401. All the way here. I think that's gonna be a better idea. At least for now. Later on, we can think about different solutions. Because definitely I want to utilize this uh, yard at Dillsborough. Uh, the thing is that right now it, it doesn't really have much of a use. Because uh, I'm assembling one freight train in... One heavy freight train in each direction and that's it. I don't really need two separate trains to do that. Well, maybe going back to Silva might require a second run, but again, I I think I need to wait for some bigger deliveries to actually be worried about this kind of problem. Anyway, 102 is now at Hemingway. Speaking of Alaska, there we go. There's that one junction that I need to throw. Because we definitely don't want trains to continue in this direction. I don't need anything to go to Y. Have a look at 203. We are to reverse. Let's do 10. The ads are in progress, so what I'm going to do about this little problem, which actually isn't a problem,
I'm gonna go and make myself a coffee. So I'll be back in three minutes. Right, everyone, I am back. And now it's time. Hmm. What is it time for? Time for these cars. I need to first pick up this cut. place where I'm rooted for okay perfect so let's do reverse 15 and I think yes this locomotive is on this side so I can 
can do road reverse five. There we go. I have to admit that heavy freight is getting longer and longer. Look at this. I'm going to attach 10 more cars to it. <laughs> That's going to be 10 more cars. And there's still more that's going to spawn tomorrow. And because except Robinson Gap call uh, that uh, that we will have to bring back, there's gonna be all the stuff for Whittier. Obviously, the Locust stuff that should technically be at the very end, but hey, I, I usually put those cars at the end, which is the only thing that uh, people at Whittier might not like, and AKA in this case. It's usually Tankis who is dealing with Whittier. Speaking of Whittier, uh, I think I got... Yes, I, I got 202 at Connolly. And that needs some slight management. Uh, orders. Yeah, there's five. Let's connect them together. Oh, okay. None of these two cars had any handbrakes on. Not sure who stowed them there, but that's not correct. go now we can reverse the movement and we need to pick up those cars perfect right meanwhile here that is ready to connect the yeah, other reverse five Okay, let's have a quick look at Bryson, just so that I can check if, okay, there's no disease there. How's the fuel situation for ARC-102? Enough water to, to get us to Dillsboro, that's for sure. Look at this. It has tons of passengers. Okay. 
good for now. Oh, there's uh, forward. There we go. Perfect. Okay, this train is now ready to reverse. That should technically get me where I wanted to. Another car. Let's reduce the handbrake. Have any handbrakes? Perfect. Now we can do road forward fifteen.
Okay. go chat look at this this entire train okay let's have a look at, at this thing select this we got 48 cars 1745 tons connected to ars well uh with arc 401 which is two cars so 46 cars connected to our fr heavy freight locomotive obviously that will quickly go down because most of that is staying at with your interchange so road forward that is limited to 30 miles an hour heavy freight trains are not allowed to go any quicker on my railway Very good. Right, so this thing is heading all the way to Whittier. Uh, 102 is heading to Ila. And at Whittier, we will have to stop it. And the best way to stop it at Whittier is to simply throw this switch. And now passenger train will have to stop at this signal. Perfect. And this switch can be thrown because I will have some cars coming back from Connelly. I think I can make it before Heavy Freight makes its way to Witcher. Uh, 202 yard forward 20 i need to extract these now 203 your job is not finished it has just begun we got this stuff paper boards s1 pw1 and sp1 parcel standard okay Let me just throw the switches. And now 203 can go road forward 15. Beautiful.
Beautiful. Okay, for now I don't need to worry about this area. Okay, there is a QZ there. We are good. Mm, Bryson, we will wait with chanting out Bryson for now. Uh, so it's only 202 that I need to worry about. But before we will do anything about 202, let me just do yard forward 2. Uh, so it will connect. And in the meantime, chat. I believe most of you are waiting for this battle to be concluded. I shall give you my blessing. Let the battle begin. Chat, that was outstanding victory. I'm really proud of you. Let us collect the rewards. Hmm. Okay, on the next level, I might get Olympiad Diamond 2 badge. I don't think we will get any further than that. Anyway, chat. Oasis is our next map. Uh, let's go forward. And then we will follow the boss path. So we will be fighting a few bosses. My healer is currently decommissioned and therefore my Barbarian will take over. And the rest is on you, chat. I believe in your abilities. Build me a massive army that will defeat all the enemies so that we can win epic loot and rewards. In the meantime, I shall head on to Dillsboro, for there is a problem. And the train has been stopped at the red board, and the reason for that is we were routed in the wrong direction. Okay, and now we will have to wait for the train to fully charge. As you can see, train brakes are very slowly charging because there is only one compressor trying to provide air for all this. And that's a no joke. So even AI will struggle with that. In fact, AI will especially struggle with that. Because it doesn't understand that braking for 
or braking too harshly might actually result in exactly this kind of behavior. Right. So this is managed and now this. Let's quickly connect the glad hands. Let's make sure that hand brakes are released. This one is. This one is. This one is. Hang on. And this one is. I think. Tankist got a bit careless. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yard forward, is it? Yard reverse 20, there we go. Now I need this one. Road reverse 15. We will still need to run around this train. Therefore, Chat, I have a feeling that the ticket prices have gone down. Perfect.
Almost there. Got the verse 20. Okay, that should do. Four oh one is passing through barkers. Progression is quite quick. And now we got two oh three. Let's quickly connect the glad hands. Unbreak can be released. And this one can go road reverse 15. Paperboard S1 is, if I remember correctly, this side track. And therefore, I can throw this switch, throw this switch. And first three wagons should make its way there. And then I will use this bit to go around, push it out, and push things where they belong. So I believe there is one car for pass and stannery. That, that will go here. And then there's three or four all cars that will just go here. In the meantime, we got disconnected at Connelly. Perfect. Handbrake was on the last car. Perfect. 202 road forward 25 which is the speed limit of Connelly Creek track. Oh, actually it's 20 miles an hour. So I might as well lower that. Just in case there is a bigger speed limit somewhere. And now we just need to pick up this bit. Okay, passenger train is waiting because we don't really have a place to go around each and every train. Uh, 401 is too close to Thomas Valley to actually mandate such behavior. And Witcher Interchange is not the best place to pass through trains, so I will wait for... 401 to make its way to Witter Interchange. Fully stop there. And then we'll figure out what to do next. So 102 will now get its speed lowered down to zero. So it won't set off when I will change the switches at uh, Interchange. And I will do so when 202 makes its way to uh, Connelly Creek. Or from Connelly Creek, there we go. Right, uh, 203 is 
almost ready. There we go. Apply the handbrake. Road four was fifteen. Throw this switch against the train because SP1 is there. Yeah, that's the one. Just enough water to complete this operation. Especially that there is nothing to pick up from these trucks. So my next destination would be Dorisboro anyway. Okay, let's have a look at 202. It should now be... Okay, it's almost where it needs to be. Look at this. Just a few meters. We got 401 approaching the signals, uh, so we need to make sure they are opened. Uh, but we also need to make sure that specific trucks will be set against the train, so it will actually stop in there. Uh, so this one needs to be set against. one needs to be set correctly. Oh, hang on. No, for a one, we'll have to wait. It's 202 that has priority. And speaking of 202, 
So there's 20, come on. gonna be sawmill train that has priority okay for once we found something with handbrakes on There we go. Timing is not the best. We got all three trains uh, actually meeting at Wit here, which is going to cause some problems. But we'll deal with them. So just as expected, 401 is now stopping at the red signal. There is no other choice, we need to wait. So I first need block crane to make its way to this siding. And the main reason being is that there are no signals on this side.
Okay, we can now throw this switch. And this switch. This opened up this signal. However, we need to close the signal. And I need to send this signal. Okay. And we also need to preset Bryson. So approach at Bryson is going to be very simple. We will have a bit longer cut than usual. Uh, but we still need to drive in. We will need to get onto this track for a change which should be long enough for everything to fit. That includes locomotive. And then shunters will do the job. While heavy freight locomotive will disconnect, refuel, go back to the shed. I will have 201 act as a shunter for coal mine uh, probably it's going to be 101 uh, doing local shunting here i was thinking about 103 to be decommissioned to walker but walker might be too difficult task for uh, 103 so i will need uh, to employ a switcher later on uh, but i was thinking about diesel switcher which will be substantially more expensive. But I'm fairly sure it's going to be a good decision. Note forward 15. Okay. How's 202 doing? 202 should now be ready. Yes, it is ready. 202 is now ready to do road reverse 15. There's 401. Status signal. Well, signal is now good. There we go. Three has switch lined against. Ah, it's this one. Oh, this road uh, forward twenty. There we go. Now let's go to the interchange. I just need to wait for this signal to be fast. Okay, perfect. Now I can throw that. We can throw that. And we can line this one again. And the train should stop somewhere around here. With most of the wagons, or pretty much all of the wagons that we need, being on this side. Perfect. 
same time. This can be disconnected and handbrake can be applied. go uh, let's go to wits here and in fact while we are performing other operations and that is disconnecting the train i might as well throw this switch go here okay uh, this one is a bit too close uh, so i need to push it closer to this switch Well, it is a lot of struggle for 401 to release the brakes. But we still need to pull this thing forward because the train didn't fit. Okay, we somehow made it through, but we are still blocking the junction. Therefore, we need to fix that situation.
There we go. Oh, chat. The ads will start soon, so we will uh, finish this battle after the ads. And I will take that opportunity to take a very quick break.
All right, everyone, I am back. My apologies for uh, this sudden break, but hey, uh, at, at least we managed to skip the adverts and, and stuff like that. I hope that everyone is now back with a fresh cup of coffee or any other brew that you might be drinking because we shall continue with the content. Right, so Stream Raiders battle is ready, so let's carry on with that. I'm, I'm fairly sure that our raiders are eager to see the outcome, although with 86 allies, I'm fairly sure that the outcome is rather obvious. Go. Cut. This was amazing. You did it, and five of you get additional rewards on top of four gold that everyone gets fantastic and outstanding performance so chat we got four battles until finishing of the trial of atlas and therefore we will perform one more battle today that this one is the last one okay so get me the best units you can find your absolute best because we will be fighting Medusa and obviously I'm going to blast her out of existence with my artillery and the rest is on you the rest is on you chat last battle of the day give me your best soldiers best army you can build for there will be no more chances today All right, everyone, the time has come. We shall continue our railway adventure and we still got few minutes to go and some stuff to do. So first things first, Bryson is being cut away. And this thing is going forward now. Okay, beautiful. We are now heading... ...to Bryson. And 202 will take care of the rest. In the meantime, 102 uh, just passed Wilmot and it's heading to Dillsboro. And 203, 203 is, well, 203 has been forgotten about. Yard forward 2. We need to quickly deal with that issue. There's still some water. Brakes released, road forward 15. Now, we need to spot the cars where they belong. Obviously, just after we throw the switches in a correct position Right 
Right, so the first car that we are going to spot is gonna go onto this track. Uh, so, I need to pass through. I might as well throw this switch, because our next destination is in this direction. I can keep this one thrown against the train, so that we won't go too far. We only have four cars in tow. and temporarily I'm gonna throw this switch at Silva because I can't be sure whether 102 is going to make it or not if it is I need to stop it somewhere and Silva is the last stop of this route uh, meanwhile I can go to 202 and let's see what we can do with it uh, right. First things first. I got this cut. Uh, Ila Farm Supply, Holfield Heating Oil, Witcher House Truck, Stenzel. Three cars for Stenzel, in fact. Quite a lot of work. Right, let's pick this up. So we can do that. There we go. So that's the first bit. I'm going to deal with then I will come back deal with Connolly Creek and it's only then that I will deal with uh, Witter Sawmill and uh, Locust Pin and uh, CO which is at Wilmot ARC203 switch lined against uh, which means that we are in a good position To do this maneuver. Orders yard forward 20.
Right, let's head on to 202. Because this one should be now ready to couple. There we go. Roll the reverse. 30. Wonderful. That is sorted. 102 is now approaching Dillsboro and 203 is now ready to push those cars where they belong. Okay, 401 is now passing through Governor's Island. Percival Silver Dragon, hello, welcome to the stream. Why you bonk me? Why you bonk me? What did I do this time? go passenger train is now heading to silver it's almost full oh my days there are so many passengers waiting for the opposite direction oh dear lord how am i supposed to fit all of them i don't even have that much money 
and that's more than 10 percent 560 dollars is more than 10 percent out of five grand what are you talking about that that's 11 percent Oh, it looks like maths is too difficult for the game. Even computers can't deal with it. It's just amazing. Right, 203 can now do reverse 15. Disease, perfect. Just perfect. Okay, this one can now speed up the therapy. This switch is thrown, perfect. And now I need 203 to refuel. And then we will begin clearing out the siding. That's gonna work. 
so we're gonna count 11 and a half okay lord i messed up so uh that's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and a half if i will place a few seeds there i believe a reversing train or a reversing locomotive should have uh, a hatch right under the water column that is my prediction chat I'm trying to measure it out for this station because I got it set up for well I know the distances for Brighton and they seem to quite reliably working at least for the locomotives that I'm using so far uh, but I haven't cracked it for Dillsborough yet And it all comes down to where do you place a few Z so that AI engineer will stop at that spot. Right, anyway, I am now waiting for 203 to go past the signals so I can throw a switch. And then I can deal with 102 and, and obviously turn it around, turn the passenger train around and send it to, to do the route in opposite way. Meanwhile, oh, 401 also arrived at Bryson. Uh, 202 is at Whittier, precisely where it should be. We can now slow down to 15. to throw the switch so the switch must be thrown Let's have a look at this one ha ah, chat see told you it's gonna fit perfect Right, so this one can be removed. I think we can actually leave it like it is. And that should be enough for this one to be more or less under polling tower. I will do it manually, just obviously trying to aim the fusee like that is not going to work for me let's have a look at 203 okay it is now making its way here we can isolate it and let's see if i aimed it properly That might, in fact, not be enough. Let's move it by two. And now it's stopped to... Oh, okay. Chat, chat. I am just slightly off. So if I would be here, I believe that would work. 
Let's just try it really quick. Yeah, that's approximately one tie difference. Let's do it again. So that would be from the end of, of that uh, concrete support. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven and a half. Let's see if my theory is right. Well, chat, you, you can't be more perfect. Look at this. That's how you do it. But that is for switcher. Any other locomotive might be in slightly different location, but come on, 11 and a half from from the end of concrete support. And that's where you place a QZ. So ARC203 can, or at least uh, that is switcher S23. And, and this one will aim perfectly where it has to be. Right. Let's go to 102. This one has 1269 gallons of water, so we will be doing stop at Dillsboro to refuel. We still got plenty of coal though. chat I could probably use longer passenger train observation car.
So we need a grand total of about 10 grand. We actually need more, but let's do that. two of those and ideally we want observation car let's have a look uh, we need another three and a half grams Equipment customize and I will need to copy that to the new one because they came in in the wrong color. this one now we can copy that to coupled there we go and there's also observation car okay oh and this one has a light at the end Okay. Also, everything wonderful wonderful chap wonderful Wonderful. 
So the investment has been made. Obviously now I need to pick up those cars and I can use 102 to actually do this. The only problem that we have right now is that observation car. Might be not the last car of the train. <laughs> oh, uh, chat, the battle is ready. Let's jump into the battle then. Oh my days, look at this. Right, I'm gonna reinforce the fences of, of this group. And then this group can beat the boss. Let the last battle of today's stream begin! Well, chat, this was amazing. I am really proud of all of you for this tremendous effort. We have beaten the boss. And we did so with passion. And Atrimi, hello, welcome to the stream. I hope you'll have a great time today. Thank you very much for the head pads, by the way. I, I didn't notice them. I was too focused watching the battle. <laughs> anyway, yes, chat, you did a uh, great job in, in this one. Uh, I'm really proud of everyone. And now it is time for us to get back to Railroader. It won't be long, uh, unfortunately, I need to go to work soon. Uh, so we will be finishing within the next 10 minutes, hopefully, so that you can avoid watching another set of adverts from Twitch. So let's quickly jump into Railroader. As you can see, I got some new cars, which we need. To add to our collection. Yes. Uh, right. The issue here is that I am already on the wrong track. Okay. Let's quickly reverse. I will use ARC 102 to do the shunting. Uh, Atrimi, it's not a palace car. It is observation car I mean palace car is a separate car and it has only uh, 50 passenger capacity So there are two separate wagons for that. Right, anyway, I need to extract those two, put them on the middle track, then go around. And uh, not exactly. So if you go to purchase menu, well, it is technically, yes, palace observation. But this is actual palace car. So, Pullman 1893 palace car is a standard passenger coach. 
It's like a first class wagon, if, if you want to call it that way. Uh, so it will have more comfy seats, uh, less capacity and, and stuff. And then you got Pullman 1893 Palace Observation Car. Which, to be honest, if you look inside, it's a weird design, honestly. It is genuinely a very, very weird design. Because you got normal standard seats for your typical passengers, probably. And then you got these uh, luxury seats for probably like uh, VIPs or, or people who decided to pay extra to, to have that smoking room. I mean was was that the thing i mean yes back in the days you could smoke in a train and, and and that was probably the best time ever and but right now everyone is moving away from smoking etc i think this one also has a toilet i'm i'm quite sure of it it is a nice car. It is indeed a nice car. Obviously, we got standard couches uh, that, that we get. Additional two, because I, I started to run out of room in my trains. So now we got great expansion and very expensive expansion, I have to say. I increased my current loan to 20,000. And in one day and 16 hours, I will have to pay interest of $1,160. So this thing better makes me money, otherwise I will be really mad. And I mean it. Uh, in fact, right now that I increase the weight of passenger train, it's easy to repay before it's due. I, I mean, yes, I know, I will make a grand. Definitely. So, the next interest I will have to pay the interest. Uh, but before the next actual repayment, I should be able to make 20 grand. But it is still a bit painful. Uh, also, for the next day, I will have to probably get. Better locomotive. Uh, will I play Railroader tomorrow morning? Uh, yes, I will be playing Railroader tomorrow. Right, I need to swap these cars in place. So, how do I want to do this? <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I'll pick those ones from this direction, extract them, then put this one, and then push it. Good, 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 good. I, I could use additional person. And make sure to update the game, because there's been some patches since last time. Okay, uh, let's have a look at 202. It's been chilling here for quite a while now. Completely forgot about it. Done already. Fantastic. Right, this one can go uh, 15 forward. With your house track is this one. And there's Holyfield speaking on it. Okay. Is there anything on Holyfield that I need to be concerned about? PRR 1529. I don't really need to be concerned about it. Ha <laughs> 
Uh, to be honest, I, I think the root mod was still better. Uh, because it sends your train back and forth automatically. Whereas... This one still requires you to do all the operations at each end. Also, I need a better locomotive for my passenger train. P18 Pacific has been obsolete now. And I was thinking about A26 Atlantic. It has 7,000 gallons of water which is very, very large tank. 13.4 tons of coal, which is great. It can go over small curve radius, which is fantastic. And it has 25,700 pounds tractive effort. But this thing costs $11,500. Well, it will in fact cost me $10,350. And I do not happen to have $10,000. $350 in my pocket. P43 Pacific. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not paying 18 grand for P43 Pacific. I'm also considering T25 consolidation. But nah, that, that might be bad. Oh, you mean that's your goal? Uh, to be honest. Hmm. I don't know how decapot uh, looks like, but 210 looks really, really impressive. But yes, as a goal, P43... But again, do you need that strong locomotive for passenger train? Uh, the answer is probably not. You don't like the look of Decapod. Uh, I've, I haven't seen it yet. I would need to see it to tell you which one I like. Uh, but I think A26 Atlantic will be a good candidate. It has good capacity when it comes to water. Good capacity when it comes to coal. Tractive effort is very good for passenger train. It's pretty much twice... Okay, it, it's less than twice as much as what I got right now. That's that express loco. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. So now, just we need to. Sort out ARC 401. Ah, I missed it. Right. Let's go in manual. Yeah, that will do. Okay, this one is refilling. 203. Uh, hang on, where's... What is 203 doing? 203 also finished refilling. I mean, now... Send it away. Too close to switch. Oh, I forgot there is a switch. 
Yeah, you can't do it with a fusida. You need to do it with manual. Have a quick look at 102. Ah, uh, where is it? I lost it. Oh my days. Oh, I, I lost it because I was looking at the wrong track. Because I'm a genius. See you tomorrow, have a good day at work. And chat. Speaking of work, I also need to go to mine. Ah, thank you for the headpads. Right, chat. Uh, I won't be dragging this any long, any longer because there is no need to. Uh, we have reached the end of today's stream. Obviously, I need to assemble this passenger train, but I can do this tomorrow morning. Uh, there is no rush with it. Okay, since I moved 203 by accident. Oh, in fact... This has not moved. Perfect. That is just perfect. Right. Uh, what was I? Yes. Uh, there is no need to, to drag it any longer. I will continue this operation tomorrow morning. For now. That is it. So, chat, thank you very much for watching my stream. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, uh, obviously, drop me a follow. That really helps this channel grow. Uh, if you are here just for Stream Raiders, fret not. Stream Raiders will continue tomorrow. Uh, so that's the first thing that we do at the start of each and every stream. I set up stream raiders and we can fight our way through uh, these epic levels. Uh, so I hope you will come and join me to actually support war efforts in that. And if you are coming here to watch or play Railroader, you can do so. Uh, all you have to do is to, well, keep watching. Uh, Ideally, drop a follow, uh, leave a trace after yourself on the chat, and that really helps. Uh, and if you want to join the game itself, it's always an open session, and the details are on my Discord server. So, the links to Discord are down below the player, so you can always find them in one of the panels. And that's pretty much it, chat. All right, before I go... Uh, let me just quickly check one thing. Uh, we might actually try and raid someone. Uh, but... The there we go. Uh, there, there was a quick sound. Right! Chat, 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 chat. There are some... Streamers. Let me just quickly check. Uh, let me just quickly check whether I can... Hmm. What are you doing?
<laughs> Hang on, let me just quickly check who's doing uh, similar stuff. Okay, okay. Okay. I think I found someone, chat. So, uh, give me a second. We might raid someone. Just hang on a minute. Uh, I need to set things up. Otherwise, it won't work. Just a second. I'm fairly sure. There we go. And now if I will do... that and then do that and then do that and then do that hang on hang on hang on hang on hang on and then do that It should work. Okay. Uh, is that no? That that's not the stuff I, I would like to. Hmm. Uh, it, it's hard to choose. It's hard. It's hard to choose, chat. <laughs> it's hard to choose chat okay uh we'll we'll deal with that in just a second okay uh we'll we'll go with this channel 